What's up, YouTube? Quick weekend video here before we get started on the week. I'm uh, happy for another YouTuber, a uh, buddy of mine that I know. Story passed between us. Him and his uh, crew, they got between like 500 and 1,000 percent gains in the last 36 hours. Uh, they did so well that one of his guys, which I thought was amazing, did like a fireworks display uh, for for the people and like uploaded the video. I thought that was, you know, that's super cool. That's the kind of community stuff AMC used to do, right? And uh, the point of the video really is to just put it out there that like there is life after AMC and after GameStop. There's still a lot of people out there that they can only talk about that those two stocks. The MOAS only includes those two stocks. Uh, there's a problem with that, guys. You guys are experiencing heavy, heavy opportunity costs. Uh, last week, I threw out MGAM G-Sun. They went up 245 and 271% in, in 24 hours. There's no one alive today in AMC or GameStop right now that would be upset if their stock ran 250 to 1,000% in, in 24 to 36 hours. They would be to the moon. They would be over the moon, you know, as the saying goes. And But for some reason, when it happens anywhere else, you know, there's issues with that. Me personally, I don't believe any of the CEOs at this point, okay? So having your CEO be AA or be this GNS guy or any CEO, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten times, shame on me, okay? Um, they're all... It doesn't matter even if they are ethical or the most awesome person ever. At some point, I, I would imagine they are all approached cash in hand by manipulators of the stock market and say, look, we need to get out of this. We've got this much money. Your camp, you need money. Your company needs money. We're going to get you to dilute. We're going to do a private equity offering. We're going to do this, that, the other. And, and, and then the play is dead. The play is over, right? For all of the unfortunate people who were in the play, uh, bag holding that play, right? So that said, for me, options is my life after AMC. Options is the way because I don't have to be caught holding any stock, any shares, or getting in and out of plays as quickly as possible, just like him and his crew. They, they didn't sit around and, and, and wait for it to go to 10 like some other people are magically trying to predict or 20, right? They took their money, they made money, and now they are now they got two eyes forward for a reason, like a predator, looking for new plays, right? And that's what the people in my Discord are doing as well. We've got over 300 people in there now. We've got 300 sets of eyes on the market at all times looking at different plays. Someone mentioned like a food company. It's like a penny stock, and I'm not big on penny stocks, but if, if anything can be learned from MGAM, G-Sun, TGL, which I was pitching to my guys last week, and Jay-Z and GNS, which is what he pitched to his guys this week, is that some of these plays can can smoke shorts in a very, very, very quick amount of time before they even have a chance to react because that is the power retail brings to the table. Unfortunately, retail does not have staying power okay this is what's changed in amc there was staying power from four plus million people for the better part of a year a year and a half okay that is not lo no longer the case okay things happen life happens people have to take their money at some point it's not you can't always just have the luxury of um actually getting out of place that's not or uh, sorry staying in place that's not always a luxury afforded to everybody you need guys some of you guys need to understand that some of these people out there they got families jobs debts loans you name it bills medical stuff that comes up and they didn't need, didn't need that cash every one of those people out of a movement that's one less person in the movement so the new movement needs to be hit it and quit it hit it and quit it that's the movement we're here to make money guys you're not going to change. The sad reality is you're not going to change the game. You're not going to roll up into the NFL and change all the rules. Make it a two-down game, flag football, because retail wants it to be. Well, you're not going to do that to the stock market either. You're not going to stop shorting. You're not going to stop 
them using dark pool. You're not going to stop their high frequency trading AI. You're not stopping anything, guys. Anything whatsoever, okay? Get it out of your heads already. You're lying to yourselves at this point. It's only causing you that pain. Um, back before AMC, just a little backstory. I got in at two, okay? Not a single YouTuber existed on AMC when it was two bucks. They they started coming out after the play ran and then the buy button was removed. And rightfully so. Everyone on planet Earth should be upset about that and Robinhood should not exist to this day because of that. Any company that had a hand in, de in removing buy button shouldn't exist. Plain and simple. That's illegal, okay? Um, that being said, nothing happened. They got a slap on their wrist. They got a fine. Where am I going with this? When I first started it, okay, guys? When I first started my trading, I was my trader. I wasn't relying on other people. I That's why I got into AMC at two bucks. Um, because it was a recovery play along with food stocks. Uh, food court stocks. Why, why, why food court stocks? Because malls had been closed. People weren't going to malls. Um, the companies that supply the food to the food courts were all taking a hit because the food courts are closed. They're not asking you for food shipments. I made it. I made AMC tight money on those plays. Okay, I really leveled my account up. You've also got. Um, you've all. You also had the airlines. Right, and then you had stocks. You see, you had stocks like uh, just random ones that went went crazy, like uh, Hertz and like um, uh, Kodak, right? Because they said Kodak was going to make twenty five percent of all the pharma. That's what Trump wanted to do, anyways. Okay, so you had a lot of catalysts and stuff, and and a lot of great, great, great opportunities. Okay, uh, but that all went away. With the, at, it's like it went away from people's minds after AMC and GameStop. It's like they just forgot. Maybe maybe none of you were traders to begin with, but it's almost like people forgot that there was an entire stock market out there that they could uh, benefit from. Like, there's a whole other world out there, guys. No one on earth was talking about food court stocks. But between you and me, you could have made 20 to 30, 40 bucks a share on some of these stocks, okay? Um, and that's kind of what I'm trying to show through my Discord, right? Uh, that you could actually go, if with four 10Xs, you could turn 1,000 into a million bucks. 1K to 10K, that's 10X. And uh, if you look at the history of my videos, it, it, almost every day I'm finding ones that are like that. I'm not saying we catch every one of them. It's impossible, but they exist. And uh, basically through through uh, a law of averages, okay, it's only a matter of time before you hit four. It's that simple. Law of averages. If, if you play 10, you should hit one, two, three four right as long as you are where they exist and you can get in on some of them now uh what else was i gonna say yeah 1k 1k to 10k 10k to 100 100k that's two trades two trades one to 10 10 to 100 two trades 100 to a million you'd have to risk a hundred thousand dollars to get a million but i how many people in amc risked 50 grand 100 grand 200 grand god knows you know god only knows what some people have risked on some plays i know some people that risked a really a lot of money on some of these meme plays and other plays that have happened since right so if you just want to here's the for the last thing i'm going to say in my video okay it never hurts to see what else is out there and to keep a set of eyes and ears on what else is out there I'm going to be keeping you apprised of the situation and options. I'm going to be bringing you a lot of news-based stuff. A lot of earnings-based plays. John Wick might be bringing you a lot of low floater potential squeeze opportunities. He often asks me about cost to borrow. So he's keeping me aware. I'm not ignoring his next call. I will tell you that much. 
He he alerted me about H uh, uh, GNS, but I was sick. I was sick since Christmas, so I was like, I'm I'm just sick, man. I'm gonna sleep it off. Slept for two days. <laughs> Whoops! Straight up, because I you know I was just I was out of it, high on meds and out of it. But between him and me, we keep alerting each other to some damn good place. He was talking about Jay Z too. He he him and his peeps went on my G son and M gam. What, how is that, how does that hurt any of us to be having a, a, a group of people that can alert and, you know, he can alert me to something and I can check out the financials of it or I can check out cost of borrow and things like that. Hey, that's a partner in life, a partner in business, guys. We're all in it to make money and get free from this all, free from the system, free from the rat race, free from the grind, free from the job or the second job or the third job, right? Free from debt. Free from a lot of things, free from stress, right? And you're not going to do that with only focusing on the past. You got to look to the future, guys, and, and and see what else is out there. So keep an eye on my channel. Join my Discord, right? It's a private Discord, okay? I put in a lot of effort and a lot of work, and there's a whole plethora of resources in there available for you guys, and I'm available for you. Premium level, uh, my DMs are open. Okay, I can only handle about 20. I've got 12 right now. I can only handle a few more. So uh, don't join a standard and try to bombard me with messages. I don't have time for it. I'm not going to be able to, to give you that time. I will be in the, in the various chat rooms with everybody. Premium is if you want to DM with me, okay? And get like, pick my brain all day throughout the week. Uh, and join John Wick's channel, subscribe, like to his channel, right? Uh, join his crew. It's like five bucks. Um, and get, follow his plays. You're going to pay for your five bucks. Follow my plays. 20 bucks ain't going to matter. Okay. Follow some of these other guys that just tell you to hold into the abyss. You might not even be able to afford John Wick's five. Okay. Uh, you might be looking at doing an Uber Eats and, and, and just taking the food. I don't know. Uh, because it ain't going to work out for some of you guys. This is an amazing day. Give me a sec. I'm about to drone all this. I'm about to hit the drone on this skyline. With the mountains in the background. Beautiful, gorgeous day out. You guys have yourselves a good weekend.